Fortnite X Mr. Beast. Ooh. <laughs> That's garbage. This is the first time I've ever seen a whole video game shipped with somebody. Oh, now you can kill him in the game. <laughs> <laughs> Yerushalayim! Oh. Yerushalayim! I, if he dies in the game, he doesn't die in real life. <laughs> I would love that, though, if, like, if you could just, like, shoot Mr. Beast in game with an AR. That'd be funny. Mm -hmm. it's, mm, hear that, Microsoft? <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Microsoft. Grant me my wishes. More. <laughs> Wait, what am I here? I don't want to go oh, here. Oh, it's a cafeteria. <laughs> Now you get to eat the ones you raised. Mm. Well, it's a chow lobby. So what? What? Uh. <laughs> oh, there, there you go. Oh. oh this is the famous scene. Listen to the dialogue. So oh yeah. Damn. You're the fake hedgehog around here. It's a Vegeta. You're comparing yourself to me? Huh. You're huh. not even huh. good enough to be I'll my make you eat those words. <laughs> you didn't even get to hear them all. Yeah. Do you know if they're if the, if they're your kind of words to eat? Those are some military grade words. Right actually, there. actually, Knuckles and Vegeta did share the same voice actor at one point. Oh, that's cool. It was in the Sonic X anime, and then later in the games. Weird. It's Dan Green for you. Wait, no, it's not Vegeta. Was he Dan Green? Was Vegeta? No. It was uh, Chris Sabat. Chris Sabat. Chris Sabat. Never mind. Is Vegeta. Uh, Dan Green was Yugi. Or, uh, Yugi's or grown big, Yugi. Big version, yeah. yeah. <laughs> His larger version. Yeah. Me when I, I walk into Walmart. <laughs> <laughs> With the gun. You're the, the one. Gun. <laughs> You're the one that comes in here every day and buys a 1.7 liter of vodka. <laughs> so you do. Oh ew, god. That face is epic, bro. <laughs> <laughs> epic. Epic. <laughs> that face is epic, man. Holy shit. Hold that epic face for me, Shadow. Oh, I want to hold your epic face, baby. Oh, Eggman's literally oh, blowing baby, up. Baby, I'm already island. five. Jesus. It's like, it's like fucking um, it's the United fun. States military in the Bikini Atoll. Yeah. What? I can't hear you. The I song is bopping though. He was talking through his teeth. Maybe that's why. Look at that song. Look at it. Whoa, song is going fast. Since when does he do that? <laughs> He's gonna become the Ayatollah Khomeini with that. <laughs> Fuck. At this rate, he'll He's become the Dalai Lama in no time. He's becoming nuclear waste grade fast. <laughs> <laughs> At this rate, he'll become the Dalai Lama. <laughs> yeah. He's about to be. Uh, he's about to become ugly at a seventh grade level. <laughs> I remember when I was ugly at a seventh grade level. <laughs> it wasn't when you were six. Fifth grade ever. <laughs> <laughs> I remember. Uh, All right, overachiever. I, I, I took AP classes in ugly. <laughs> <laughs> I took, yeah, I was in honors. Bro. Uh, on, I was in uh, honors fugly. Uh, yeah. <laughs> AP, AP hideous. I got the. <laughs> I was cum, cum laude ugly. Cum <laughs> laude. I graduated under a hood. <laughs> I don't come quiet, I come louder. <laughs> Whoa, I don't think I've ever seen this path. It's neat. The path of the six sages. The path of the Jedi is one fraught with tension. <laughs> Everybody you meet is oh. going to be super fucking ugly, except for you. You... You're gonna wanna fuck, but not any of them. <laughs> the problem is, you have to fuck them. You know what I just learned? Um, I learned that... Um, the... You <laughs> <laughs> suck. <laughs> you scoff. <laughs> oh, you learned something, huh? You know what I just learned? <laughs> no ah. Nobody learns anymore, dude. We already know. Yeah. He's, like, uh. floating with, like, <laughs> objects around the gravitational pull of his head. Is it like one of them is just like a happy Twinkie? I already know two plus two equals me. So what the fuck? <laughs> did you have an IQ of four? So what did you learn, Three. Andres? I learned that the uh, the actress who played uh, Claire Temple is also the actress who plays Ahsoka Tano. Yeah. 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 That's cool. Um, I forgot. Uh, Rosario Dawson. Yeah, Rosario yeah. Dawson. Ahsoka Tano. Yeah, Ahsoka Tano. Oh, I thought you said Ahsoka Tano. Ahsoka Tano. Ahsoka Nahato? Hato Time Machine? Hato Time Machine 7. No, but seven. I am. <laughs> this time they're going forward in time. <laughs> but I am I am curious. Did you did you watch it? No. There were so many of those like weird mid 2000s movies that were just like where the the name of the movie was the entire plot and concept. Isn't that how titles work? No. <laughs> Like, I mean, sometimes. No! Oh, no, well, I mean, you think Airplane? Movie, the Terminator? 
Yeah, it's about the Terminator. That's not the plot, though. The <laughs> plot isn't, like, hot to <sighs> Fuck. Maybe you're right. <laughs> <laughs> but go on. I don't know, but but, but it felt felt way more obvious. It felt like the Matrix feels way more meaningful of a title than like Hot Top Time Machine or Scary Movie. <laughs> like Scary Movie is just like, what are you gonna go see? The Scary Movie. Well, that's that's, that's a, it's supposed to be because it's a joke. Oh, because it's okay. like parody. Um, but there, there, I feel it's like, like that whole line though, like superhero movie was. Oh yeah, superhero. yeah, they were all by the that the the that pair of directors who were just making parody movies. <laughs> Whoa. The Bless you. <laughs> I'm gonna watch Chowski you die. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, dude. That was 3D shit. Dude, if I was in the 1920s, I'd have freaked out. <laughs> <laughs> if it if was you like, were... first the train, now this. If you were in the 1920s, you'd be hanging from a tree. <laughs> <laughs> oh, best song in the game. No. Unironically, though. No. I disagree with you. Man. Hell yeah. Look at that bass. There's no bass. Merge with balloon. <laughs> Merge with <laughs> me and my mother. It's Bismarck's uh, it's Bismarck's highest power Pokemon move. Merge, Merge with, with balloon. Merge with it's actually okay. no Bismarck sounds uh, like a magic card. Yeah, that's his favorite like two drop spell. <laughs> Merge with balloon. <laughs> These things used to freak me out, dude. Oh, those little go. Oh yeah, the Get face is really uncanny. Like especially the eyes. The eyes look. Oh jeez, great. <laughs> I did not. I wasn't a jump scare. I don't know what you're talking about. You got I ghosted. Didn't, no, shut up. <laughs> that actually did scare me. <laughs> I'm not to you. Look, look at that fucking skybox. I love that. That actually looks really well done. Yeah. It's great. Skybow. So <laughs> like, it, okay. So I'm not sure. You guys are. <laughs> look at this guy. <laughs> <laughs> look at him. I'm tickled. <laughs> He's tickling you in all the right places. So look at this not, red knuckle. So you're not sure what? Uh, so you guys are slightly older than me. So you probably have like oh, shit. a bit more personal, like anecdotal knowledge about video games. At I the know time. more about the world than you. Yes. <laughs> Listen. Why don't you live a little before you judge me? Okay? Oh no! <laughs> oh, don't bring that up. Oh god! Okay, yo, Save yeah. Save that for another time. <laughs> what, what were you gonna? Say? I was just gonna ask, like, um, when you guys were like real young, like, but young enough to like remember, um, did you ever see like Sega consoles in stores? I don't. I don't. I like. Honestly, I don't remember them until like I've seen like YouTube videos about them. I was like, I didn't know these existed. Like, I thought I just knew about Nintendo really, and I and PlayStation and Xbox. I don't remember seeing. I think at that that point when I gained consciousness, I think Sega was like dying. I remember yeah. Nintendo sixty four consoles being like on the shelves. Yes. Yeah. Oh, okay. And then the boxes. Sure. That's weird because like Toys R Us. If, man. if you were like, okay, so you were born in ninety five, right? Mm -hmm. So say you're like five years old, you can like remember going into a Toys R Us or something. That's 2000. That's mm -hmm. like the PlayStation's already out. Yeah, I remember the PlayStation too. I remember. But the, the Saturn is also out. Yeah. You should have been able to like at least see the Saturn. But that was just like when they were, were just dying out. Oh, yeah. yeah. At that point, uh, Sonic Adventure was already ported to the GameCube. Oh, shit. Or, or I guess a little bit after like that. Like the DX cut? Or yeah. the director's cut? Yeah, yeah, because cause the dream. Nobody was buying Dreamcast, so they're like, fuck it, port it on the GameCube. Mm. That's weird to think about. There we go. Yeah. I do, I do, I have like, I remember going to a. A, a Toys R Us and um, walking out with a Lord of the Rings four pack of toys and uh, Super Smash Brothers the original one on the N64. Damn, that's weird. Your like, mom was loaded. When, <laughs> when I was like, I think that was by my birthday or something. I remember when I was like just becoming conscious and able to remember going into like Toys R Us's with my mom and Targets and shit like that. I think the most recent console or gaming thing I remember seeing was Game Boy Advance. Oh yeah. It's like I don't I don't think oh, shit. N64 shit was being sold anywhere that wasn't like a GameStop. Yeah. That's weird how I like I bought the the Target by Brandon's house is the Target I bought Mario Kart Double Dash in. Really? I That's remember that. Cool. And then I remember fucking buying Melee. Oh, I remember Melee too. I think that was I the love I oh go on my bad. No, I, was, I just that was literally I like my brain literally shut off when I was like that was the first. <laughs> no, I'm sorry. No, no, it, it was nothing. To you, it was just my brain was like that's the end of it. You just didn't want to eat a wolf. Um. Oh nice. no, it's okay. It was just that that was the first game game I got. Mm -hmm. It wasn't the first, but it was the most. Ex it's the one I was most excited for. <laughs> and I remember when Brawl was coming out because I actually got the GameCube later into his life. But when mm. Brawl was coming out, um, I remember playing Super Smash Bros. Melee like a ton. 
because I was like, I want to be, go I want to be really good when Brawl comes out because that's gonna be the next big Smash thing. <laughs> and, and little did I know. And then you trip. <laughs> I remember when I got Melee, uh, the co the car ride back home. I was just flipping through like the yeah, booklet. Yeah, oh like, this dude. is so cool. Yes, the Melee booklet. The Melee booklet was really fleshed out. Oh yeah. yeah. I like literally remember like each character had like a like a two a page, page. Yeah. Like, a, yeah, like yeah. with their moves and all the. I really like the instruction booklet for uh, Legend of Zelda Minish Cap because it has so many cool little. Um, like illustrations of all the characters. Yeah. I don't remember really liking all the characters' aesthetics, especially uh, like Vati. I remember like, whoa, Vati's so fucking cool. Yeah. It's like an edge lord, like me. <laughs> those those Nintendo uh, like manuals were like really fleshed out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then I'd get like Sonic Heroes, and it was entirely black and white, and, like, five <laughs> pages. <laughs> uh, I remember. Uh, 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 I also remember buy, going to Costco with my grandma, and she bought me Battle Network Three Blue. Whoa! Oh my God! I can't. I forgot about that. Was that him laughing? Yeah. It's like blah blah blah. That was me laughing. Oh my God! Look at that, that child, dude. Jesus Christ! Abort it! I th I think that child's still like. I think it's still connected to the womb. <laughs> I don't think it's developed a gag There's reflex no yet. Oh, he usually does have subtitles. That's weird. I am great. I am genius. You see that? Yeah. Oh, yeah, this is where he fucking... He pisses on the moon! <laughs> the Ark. No, cantaloupe. The bark of the company. <laughs> Someone in the audience is like, my melon! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. It's owl, owl face. That was, um... That was a whole-ass colony, right? Why do they not use that shit? <laughs> it's Eggman, bro. <laughs> I remember being so, like... No fucking way! He blew up the moon. To be completely fair, like that looks pretty cool. Like seeing this in a video game probably would have blown anybody's mind, like any kid's mind. It's like oh, holy geez. shit! Like the moon it fucking exploded. Yeah, <laughs> this is the crater. That there's just a guy in the toilet reading, reading a newspaper. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Look at that shot. That's amazing. It's terrible. That's like um, that was like <laughs> the ending of Custom Robo for me. How it became like entirely way too real. At the end, <laughs> we have to play that game. If only because like multiplayer is fun first off, but the story is beautiful too. She's so angry. She can count. <laughs> oh, that blasted creep! That pedophile! <laughs> <laughs> Just like, wow, he blew up the moon. That fucking nuts. That rapist. <laughs> <laughs> that traffic violator. <laughs> that really like, real specific insults. I bet he jaywalked last night. <laughs> I, 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 bet, I bet his mom to taught him how to embezzle. <laughs> this is the coolest, coolest Sonic's been because he ran from the cops. Nice. This is also the most evil Eggman has been. Oh yeah, because he destroyed the fucking moon. And he's actually giving like a timer. Oh yeah, or it'll destroy the Earth. Yeah, I was like, Jesus, dude, chill out, man! <laughs> Goddamn! What is with these characters, bro? Eggman's gotta get some McBoos. <laughs> Egg... A McBoos. <laughs> McBoos. Can go Hello, can I have one of your McBooses? <laughs> Going to McDonald's and harassing the minimum wage workers there. Yeah, you like, want fries with that? <laughs> Our pussy machine isn't working, <laughs> loser! <laughs> Why don't you get out of here? <laughs> Why don't you go harass the Burger King people? <laughs> I'm sure they'll get you a McPussy. Uh, that would be the best they if we tried to just like, like, pull that shit on somebody at McDonald's and they just 360 us. <laughs> Look at that over there on the sign. Miles Tails Prover. A million! <laughs> a million shit. what? Oh, oh, okay. A million doubloons. Doubloons. Oh, you were the made of Spanish doubloons. There you oh, go. Oh shit. Oh shit. Look, he got how, his code back. Why? A booster. <laughs> That's how I got my boosters. <laughs> you just, you like, just found them. You yeah. found them like on a floating city street. Yeah, just glowing. You it's know, just it's, a rite of passage. Tails should already be wanted by the federal government because, like, look at the weapons this ki this kid has. Yeah, and he's like six. Oh fuck! It's I not, thought he was older than Tails. It's not the government. Or than business. <laughs> than uh, than Amy. <laughs> then no, yeah, yeah, Amy's twelve. Amy's 12. And Tails is 6. Tails is 6, yeah. Oh, well, that's because he has two Tails, so it's like, you know, he ages twice as fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not my bad. What? Tails got that fucking, like, upper arm strength for days. Dude, he's holding the whole thing. Damn. One on the steering wheel, one on that boost. And one in the car. Whoa. Trump would have been proud, bro. <laughs> Tails is my favorite character. Trump wasn't even, like, born when this came out, though. <laughs> Tails is my favorite character. Sega himself Tails? said to me, he said, Sega. I love Tails. <laughs> he's the best. It's Mr. True. Sega. 
Mr. Naka. <laughs> Mr. Mr. Miyamoto, he said, he said, I love tails. <laughs> it's true. He said that to me. Are and you I guys? Like, I, lo I love tails too. I love test tubes. I love test tubes. I love a test tube. You love a test. Or Trying to dance. You should love them too. The Eiffel of test tubes. <laughs> the Eiffel of Tesla. What? The Eiffel of Tesla. The Eiffel test tube. The <laughs> Eiffel powers. <laughs> Join the Eiffel powers. <laughs> Wait, wait. Me when I'm trying to pee, but also have a cold. Wait, wait. Wait, wait. This is Brandon just like, like kicking down the door to the Target bathroom, unzipping his pants, and going, wait. <laughs> wait. Oh, oh, fuck. I literally just walked off. Tails has a booster. How come he can't fucking fly? I love boosters. Yes, That's I what do. my booster did to me. What? Mm. My wings haven't worked recently, though. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> Let's get hit by this. Oh, why did you speak, Andres? Do you forget that you're an aunt? The U.S. is bombing <laughs> Tails Bekistan. <laughs> Tails Bekistan. <laughs> oh no, missile. Remember when we watched Borat together? That was fun. That was a good time. Borat. We should watch more movies together. We should watch Borat too. I'm down. Escape to Borat. Escape it, it was like to Boratia. It was filmed like well, fuck. It was Whoa. filmed like at the peak of a um, cool. lockdown. Oh damn. This is funny. Covidia. Yeah. yeah, that was peak lockdown. <laughs> peak lockdown. I also I want to watch uh, more of those Sasha Baron Cohen mo movies with guys. Yeah. Like The Dictator, I've heard is really good. It is not. Never mind. <laughs> I watched it. It works because it's not like um, not like Borat where it's like oh like you know, exposing film. people. Um. Oh yeah. <gasps> Dude, that's what we should watch though. We should watch uh, Look Who's Back. Yeah, that's right. Have you heard of that one? Yeah, yeah. You talked about where it's like a guy dressed as Hitler. No, no. It's like Hitler. Um. Like is revived. Like uh -huh. he he was like in his bunker for like decades, and all of a sudden he wakes up in modern Germany. Um, and like the first, ooh, okay, that's cool. The first half of the movie is him kind of like it's like the fiction part where he's just like, oh, I I need to find myself a new like a Fourth Reich party. Mm -hmm. um, but then like a lot of the movie is kind of like Borat, where it's this dude dressed as Hitler going up to these German towns, like German city folk mm -hmm. um and it's weird because a lot of them aren't just rural people like a lot of people in the cities and and he's asking them are you going to join my fourth reich have you noticed that a lot of the immigration laws have been inconveniencing you and they're like yeah yeah we just don't really like the people who are coming into germany and it's like real shit yeah like they're just exposing them because yeah. that was actually that was uh, that came out around um I think it was like several months before Trump's Trump uh, being elected. Really? Is that recent? Yeah. It's a very recent movie. Um, and I guess it was all the more powerful because at that time Poland um, had a very um, Poland had a very powerful alt right party that was gaining a lot of traction in their um, what do you call it? Their parliament mm -hmm. and Germany uh, Germany's alt right movement was you know because you can't really be vocally alt-right in Germany because of their history. Yeah, um, yeah. But they were showing a lot of support in Poland as German citizens. So it was a wild fucking time. That movie was fucking great for, you know, being that. Yeah, yeah. No, Tropic Thunder. <laughs> I'm down to watch that with you guys, too. We always say we're going to watch Tropic Thunder together, and we never do. The, the only... The only the good part about the dictator was that part where he's, like, talking to, like, Congress. He's like, could you imagine being a dictatorship? You could, you and your friends could all get rich by by buying all the other companies and keeping them on your own. That's right. And you don't have to do any work. And you, and you could stay as the one percent. You could even make make laws that that just that just target poor people and black people. <laughs> and you could put them in prisons. That way, you don't have any enemies. I, Can you just, I know this is hard for you to imagine, America, <laughs> but please do. I remember reading that in a nine gag post yeah. where it was like the it was just like um, screenshots of the film with that whole like monologue. Yeah, I remember reading that, and not really being like a leftist at the time because mm -hmm. it was nine gag days, but I was also <laughs> like. This makes sense. Yeah. Wonder why. Hmm. Hmm. Shadowing. And then you look at the camera and you go, ooga booga. <laughs> I don't know why you do that, but you do. 